السلام علیکم مائی نیم از تیمو سکندر اینڈ ویلکم بیک ٹو انادر سیریز آف سٹی گائڈ ایپلیکیشن ٹوڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو اسٹارٹ دا فائر بیس سیریز اینڈ دا فرسٹ ویڈیو از گوئنگ ٹو بی ہاؤ ٹو سیٹ اپ فائر بیس ان اینڈرائڈ اسٹوڈیو اوکے سو لیٹس گیٹ اسٹارٹیڈ ود دا فرسٹ پوائنٹ گو ٹو دا ٹولس اینڈ چوز اے فائر بیس ہیئر سو ان سائڈ دس فائر بیس وی نیڈ ٹو سرچ فار ایٹ دا ٹاپ یو کین سی وی ہیو ریئل ٹائم ڈیٹا بیس سو کلک آن دس so before going to click on this connect button to firebase there are two things you need to have the first one is the internet make sure your device have the active internet connection and then you can see account over here and if you don't have any account you just have to click on this add account and make sure you have an active account in here because on this account android studio is going to create a firebase account for you so click on this connect to firebase button you will be redirected to this screen you can see the same user id i am using so in here you can select any previous account uh, but i am going to create a new one so click on add project into the name click continue accept the changes click continue and again you need to define select your desired country from here analytics location and then you need to accept these two terms and conditions then click on create project click continue now you can see a pop up appears uh, in manual way it is not going to happen so uh, you just have to click on this connect button to connect your android studio with the firebase and now you can see a message which is saying that Android Studio project is connected to the Firebase so let's just open it and now you can see a connected button over here and in the bottom you can also have a connected message so after that we need to add some dependencies inside our project once it's connected you just have to click on this add real time database to your project and we have bunch of dependencies So automatically these are going to be added inside our city guide project so you just have to click on accept changes and wait for few seconds and in here you can see after a successful sync we have a dependency set up correctly message which means that app is connected and dependencies for the real time database has been added so go back and in the authentication section at the top you can see we have email and password authentication so to use any type of firebase authentication we need to add this authentication dependencies as well so let's click on them and this is basically a single firebase auth dependency so accept changes now you can see this authentication dependency has been successfully added to the application so let's just minimize it and this is how you can set up your firebase in the android studio that's it for this video thank you for watching if you learn something new please like the video and if you are new to the channel please subscribe it again thank you for watching take care allah hafiz